Hello, I'm Siu Eng and I'm leading a group in inflammatory bowel disease and microbiota at the Chinese University of Hong Kong. I'm delighted to discuss our work on the gut virum in patients with ulcer colitis published in Gut recently. The microbiota field has attracted a lot of attention recently, but most of the microbiota studies in inflammatory bowel disease has focused on the bacterial microbiota and the relationship with the host. In recent years, our laboratory at the Chinese University of Hong Kong has great interest on the dark matters of the gut, including the gut virum. These are mostly prokaryotic viruses and they consist of both DNA and RNA viruses that infect bacteria. Our group believes that they may just be as important as the gut bacteria in many human diseases. So in this study, we hypothesize that changes in the viral community populating the gut mucosa may play an important role in ulcer colitis pathogenesis. In order to conduct the study, we recruited ethnically Han Chinese from three regions of China, including Hong Kong, Beijing and Xiangsan. And almost 100 patients with ulcer colitis and equal age and sex match controls were included. From these subjects, we first took rectal biopsies through colonoscopy and then we enriched the virus-like particles in these biopsies. We then performed metagenomic sequencing on the enriched virum preparations. So what are the results? First, we found that ulcer colitis is characterized by changes in the mucosa viral biota with also distortion in the functions of these viruses. When we look a little bit further at the inflamed mucosa, we found that there's an expansion in the mucosa virus, especially the bacteriophages in the inflamed tissue compared with non-inflamed tissue. And at the same time, the virum diversity was also decreased. So gut inflammation seems to exacerbate the gut virum dysbiosis. Also, a research assistant professor from the Chinese University of Hong Kong. I will explain our findings in detail. The total virus abundance was significantly higher in UC rectum than healthy subject rectum. However, UC subject showed decrease in mucosal virus diversity and richness compared with the healthy subjects. If you look at the mucosal virus configuration, you may find out that most of the mucosal viruses are bacteriophages from the outer cardiovascular and the cardiovascular are present more abundantly in UC mucosa than healthy mucosa. Interestingly, the inflamed mucosa showed more enri enrichment of both total viruses and cardiovascular loads than non-inflamed mucosa of UC pa patients. Compared with healthy control mucosa, inflamed mucosa of UC patients also showed a significant decrease in diversity, evenness, and richness of total viruses and cardiovascular loads. The results suggested that the gut mu Gut mucosal inflammation is associated with the exacerbated mucosal virum dysbiosis in UC, and the phages may play a role in gut inflammation. We next identified viral taxons that were differentially present between UC and controls at the family, genus, and species levels. There were higher abundances of cardiovascular loads, uh, such as uh, enterobacteria phage and Escherichia phage in UC relative to control mucosa. However, a variety of family of eukaryotic virus were relatively higher in controls than in UC. To assess functions of mucosal virum, we queried the viral sequences against the gene ontology and the p protein protein uh, protein family database. Due to the largely underexplored nature of gut mucosal virum, uh, we were only able to characterize the function of a small proportion of the viral race, though the most abundant function did not differ in abundance between healthy individuals and UC. Healthy individuals showed a richer viral function, whereas UC subjects exhibited a significant abolishment of functions. Nonetheless, several molecular functions were determined to be more abundant in UC than in healthy mucosal virus, all of which were linked to phage lysis bacterial host as well as functions of bacterial origin. And this result implies that enrichment the mucosal viral function in UC were associated with bacterial thinness, pathogenicity, and biotic resistance. We also assessed the correlation between bacterial genera and the viral species in control and UC mucosa. A larger number of bacterial viral correlations were seen in controls than in 
you see, and most of the correlations were negative correlations. However, a substantial contraction in the number of significant bacterial viral correlations were observed in UC mucosa. Meanwhile, the correlation in UC were weakened compared to that in controls. Moving forward, we believe that, based on these results, therapeutic approaches involving reducing the abundance of mucosal cardiovirus bacteriophage, including enterobacteriophage, and also to reconstitute the gut microbial homeostasis, may represent a promising therapeutic approach for ulcerative colitis.